Hey guys and welcome back to your fifth scripting tutorial which I'm gonna teach you about variables and finally I am gonna teach you about something related to script so yeah right so we are gonna go ahead and insert the script right so what is a variable uh, well variable holds an information of some sort so for example uh, test equals to um thing right my favorite season wait there should be no species equals um uh, summer right so that's a variable but it it doesn't always need to be a uh, string value it can be any of sort of some sort of value so let's see uh my age equals uh 200 right um and it could be like i live they just call it like so but you it can be anything like uh, this thing like in the name of it i live a uh, script dot parent and you can change it actually so um let's just say i wrote like this uh test no not tvs test uh, equals nothing right and if we uh, wrote like this um first of all we print uh test wait uh let's just print it like so because test uh no let's just say like that before and you can write anything in there and those two dots uh, i wrote is like called con concatenation but it just connects two things two strings and then uh it just uh, does that all right and if, if we wrote test so if we run it should say before test before thing you know and I wrote be this before because I gonna print like now print uh, after test and it should print after nothing right so yeah well that's because some typos there well if I wrote like this column and space it should print like so right yeah so pretty simple right and now let's just uh, uh, do a kind of same thing to all the value all right let's just try to print my age right if we wrote like this it should print an error but no well uh, it just makes it to, to string probably because it's a number you know but uh let's just try to say like this i live uh, and it should print er an error because it's not possible right so if we wrote like this and if we run it should print an error yeah as you can see because it's a user data value and you cannot do like this but if we wrote uh like uh, two string wait two string this thing it should print the way we want i live in workspace says the script right okay so you know now you know how you, you use the variables so you may ask why do we need them why i can't just uh, set the value like script dot parent equals a, a workspace or something and then I gonna answer because you can simply just write like this um uh script uh, well you just uh, write from a capital because if you're uh, if uh, it changes color by the way if you really want to know why is why it's my colors not the same as yours because i need to write like the, uh, go there to file advanced no not advanced uh settings and you can alternatively 
press alt s and then you can change uh, those settings you know those colors so background you know built-in function comment and stuff so yeah pretty simple right so yeah so we can write like this script equals script dot parent and now we can just wrote like this script equals no 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 from a capital s and if you wrote like this script equals workspace pretty simple and this is how we change the variables and as you can see no errors also i have to mention that those variables you know are in the they work only in the script so yeah uh, if we are, i write like any other script you know like this and i just gonna uh, like there is it just doesn't show up you know this script from a capital as you can see there is no you know so yeah the only this one but we can enter we can just uh, just enter those values where is that number value and we can just uh, set the value I don't know 25 right and then we can just do like this um, script dot parent dot value dot value no not the dot archival dot dot value right and then if we print a script from a capital it should print 25 as you clearly can see right so and if you like name this one and name this two right um and then if you print like this uh script that parent that value that value it should say uh, also 25 clearly as you can see so yeah that's pretty simple tutorial i hope you guys learned something if you have any questions post in the comments and i'll see you next time goodbye